Let me show you how whims can bring the vim and vigor back to your character. So what exactly are whims? Essentially think of them like magic potions. You take them to gain extra abilities of something. Let me show you some examples. In my backpack, I currently have multiple different types of whims. Living armor, utter delight, spring legs, the weaver, predator, and arrow leap. Each of these have a different ability. For example, living armor has an effect called chlor armor. It activates when the HP drops below 20%. You recover 100% of your HP within five seconds before losing coro armor, but then you cannot use it again for another 10 minutes. Spring legs lets you jump higher at the cost of a little extra stamina and others. These can be incredibly useful. As far as I've seen, every whim lasts for 7,200 seconds. Utter Delight is a unique whim because what it does is extend the other whims by 35%. It's certain deviates that provides the pieces to make these whims. They're the magic sauce that allows you to make these potions. The Disco Ball is used for the Utter Delight. The Heart Seed Deviant produces heart vine pieces. These pieces you collect and then use at the workbench to craft your whims. You can only have six active whims at any given time. As well, the same whim cannot stack with itself. So if you have living armor already applied, you cannot apply a second living armor and get extra effects. But it can get a little confusing what is and isn't active when you have multiple whims. So if I put on Utter Delight, Spring Legs, The Weaver, and let's say Arrow Leap, I now have those whims all applied. You can see how much higher I am jumping because of spring legs, but it does take up that extra stamina. There are two different places to look to see what whims and how many you have active. The first is on the bar below. You see in the second category, there is a number. Right now it's currently four. That is telling me that I have four whims currently active. However, it does not tell me which whims are active. To do that, I would hit the I button and on the lower right, hover over that same symbol. This will not only tell me which whims I have active, but explain what they are and exactly how much time is left on them. As you see, we do have the note here that you can only have six whims active at any given time. Utter Delight does count as one whim. And that adventures is a brief overview of whims and how to use them. If you want further details on what deviants provide what whims, please reference my Deviant Explained videos. I have not done every single deviant yet. I'm currently in the process of doing so. Stay tuned if there's a deviant that you're looking for that I've not done yet. Now for a giveaway question. What is the maximum amount of whims you can have on you at any given time? Leave your answer in the comment section down below. Please use only numerical numbers. Do not spell it out. But for now, adventurers, I will see you in the next video. Bye bye